Coronavirus may be getting even more complicated. In China, there are now reports that doctors are seeing COVID-19 manifest differently among patients in a new wave of cases in the Northeast region there. Now, this news comes as the biopharma company Sorrento Therapeutics reported it found an antibody capable of inhibiting COVID-19 in a preclinical trial. We are pleased to have with us now Sorrento Therapeutics founder and CEO, Dr. Henry G. Uh, doctor, thanks so much for being with us. Um, this sounds uh, promising, but first off, just tell people what, what this is and what might it do if it were to hit market. Yes, uh, this is a, a neutralizing antibody. That means that prevents the uh, virus from infecting the normal healthy cells. So if you have a virus just hits you and it gets into your body, say somebody sneezes at you, if you have a neutralizing antibody that circling around in your body, and you will be able to uh, uh, have the antibody wrap around the virus before they even get into the healthy cells. So this way the virus will not get into the healthy cell. You know, a virus needs to be uh, replicated, propagated, in the normal healthy cells. Without the uh, virus getting into the cell, you will not see the virus infection or the complication with it. So the key is you need to have a neutralizing antibody that prevents the virus gets into the cell. And doctor, what's the next step? Uh, when should we expect this to be used on consumers? Where can you get it? What's the timeline? The first thing uh, you have to do a clinical testing. And uh, we are planning to get all the package needed to submit to the FDA, get the FDA uh, approval to get into human, sometimes in the next two to three months. It will get into the human if testing is uh, safe and potentially have a, a therapeutic effect, then we can move into uh, preventing the virus uh, infecting the normal healthy uh, people. And that means we are, we're hoping this uh, could be uh, getting to the uh, uh, market sometimes uh, uh, very quickly if we get the FDA consent. You know, it's, I, I know it's probably not the thing you're focused on, but us here at Yahoo Finance, we look at how stocks are reacting. And Sorrento has had quite a run, as had other uh, companies in this space, Moderna included. Uh, your stock uh, of Sorrento Therapeutics has soared more than 70% recently. Uh, the stock is coming back down a little bit, but um, what's your thinking on how Wall Street is seeing or interpreting what it is your company is doing? Do they have it right? Do investors have it right right now? So, so what are we focusing on instead of watching the stock going up or going down? And uh, we're focusing on make sure we have the real deal. So you have the uh, uh, antibody that gonna prevent the virus infecting the healthy cells. That means you're gonna have a real product. If you have a real product, eventually the stock are gonna be uh, reflecting the uh, uh, assets you have. And we believe right now, probably uh, there's a lot of investor excited about the story. However, there is a lot of investor suspecting this is another pump and dump, which is uh, typical, which is normal, but we don't believe that's the case. And uh, we have working with ac academic collaborator was a real virus infection. When you see a virus, it's not infecting the healthy cell. You know, you have the real deal. And I think eventually the market catching up. As you know, uh, in short term, the uh, uh, stock uh, price is a, way, uh, uh, is a voting machine and uh, eventually is a weighing machine, as a, you know, Warren Buffett said. So I think eventually they will ref reflect the uh, value we have here. You know, doctor, just a... Uh, uh to alleviate any concerns that this would be some type of pump and dump, you own 2% of the outstanding shares of the company. Are you uh, inclined to go out there and buy more stock and will you be doing that soon? Because, uh, you know, as a company executives, I can only buy uh, stock when there is no inside information. At this moment right now, I cannot buy any uh, stock. And uh, as you can tell from my history, I bought the stock at the nine buck, I bought stock at 13 buck because I believe the value we have created through the 11 years, we have very big assets in the therapeutic antibody collection we have, and we have a multiple compounds in the uh, uh, phase three and uh, clinical stage. We have one drugs FDA already approved. So what we do in the real thing sometimes takes time for people to realize what we have. 
Doctor, I was looking over your, your financials for last quarter. The company lost close to $70 million. Uh, you have cash on hand of a little under $22 million. Is there a concern here that you might run out of cash, uh, and are there plans to raise more? We always have a concern. As a, a CEO of the company, you always have concern that you want to make sure you have enough cash to get the uh, uh, product developed and potentially uh, commercialize it. So we have a lot of tools, as you can tell. We have a lot of tools to our uh, uh, in our hand, so we can uh, uh, getting the uh, financing we need it to uh, support our dream to uh, develop the uh, therapeutic product that potentially uh, conquered the uh, COVID nineteen pandemic. Doctor, are you nearing any partnerships um, with some other with some larger players to help manufacture this? So we are in a constant discussion with different players, but in this case, we believe the antibody we have, we have the CGNP facility, we can manufacture them very easily. We can produce in the hundreds of thousands of doses, up to a million doses ourselves without any help from anybody. But of course, we welcome any partnerships and the potential government support as well. So we are pursuing the different angles for uh, to scale up the manufacturing. All right, Dr. Henry Ji, founder and CEO of Sorrento Therapeutics. Best of luck with the antibody. We all wish you well. Thank you. Appreciate it. Hey, investors. Zach Guzman here. Are you interested in learning more about the markets and getting the latest financial news? Well, then click right here to subscribe to our Yahoo Finance YouTube channel. Get the latest up-to-the-minute market analysis, big interviews in the world of finance, and information on how to manage your money every day wherever you are.